Now to new details tonight emerging about the Georgia teenager accused of a mass shooting at his high school. Tonight, 14-year-old Clayton Gray and his father are behind bars. 54-year-old Colin Gray faces several charges, including involuntary manslaughter and second-degree murder. CBS News has learned police and federal agents are investigating whether the weapon used in the shooting was purchased by the teen's father as a gift last year. That's according to four federal law enforcement sources close to the investigation. Last night, the FBI announced they spoke to the teen and his father last year after receiving anonymous tips connected to a school shooting threat. At the time, the teen denied posting those threats, and his father said he owned guns, but his son did not have access to them. These charges stem from Mr. Gray knowingly allowing his son, Colt, to possess a weapon. I wish it was all just a dream. I mean, me and my team, me and my friends, we could all just wake up and it's just still Wednesday morning. Four people were killed in the shooting. 14-year-old Christian Angelo and Mason Schirmerhorn were students at the school. Richard Aspinwall was a teacher and coached the football team. Christina Erme taught algebra. Nine others were injured. Seven of them have been released from the hospital.